Crummy, you've been used in uh, various different roles in the team recently in, in midfield and defence. Uh, how are you finding things? Yeah, no, obviously the results haven't been brilliant. Um, we're trying extremely hard to change that round. Uh, I'm I'm enjoying playing football and obviously I can play in these different positions but the most important thing at the moment is to get a result and we need to change things around quickly. Got a cracking goal obviously against Hampton for your first goal for the club and uh, when you have been used in the uh, midfield roles you've been getting forward more and more is that something that you're looking to show off in, in your game to the Yellow Army because you might not have seen that so far so much because you've been using the mainly defensive role. Yeah definitely I think um, obviously I'll I was carrying a, an injury at the start of the year and I feel fully fit now so hopefully I can carry on with my driving runs and get shots, get crosses in and hopefully nick a few more goals. And obviously looking at the last two games, the team as a whole now, obviously the 4 all draw against Altering and then the 1-0 defeat against Eastleigh, it seems to be very much a thing of trying to put the two parts of the performances together. To score four goals against Altering is great, but much more resolute performance of against Eastleigh, trying to find combine those two may well bring success, might it? Yeah, of course, you need to get the balance spot on, especially at this level, because every team is a good team at this, at this at this level, so we need to get the balance and do it quickly. And talking about good teams, obviously they don't get much better than Notts County, who are flying high at the top of the table. Um, but we've got to go there to, to compete because we've, we've uh, there's three points to play for and anything can happen on the day, can't it? Yeah, exactly. I think we've all been in this league long enough to know it's a National League team first, another National League team. So we've got to go there, all guns blazing, and give it a right go. And you're one of the more experienced players in a predominantly young group. Are you able to sort of pass on that knowledge to any of the young players to try and talk them through this rather difficult period at the moment? I, th I think as an experienced player and the few experienced players that we've got, I think it's all about just working hard, coming into training, and knuckling down, getting together as a group and just working through this tough period. Well, thank you for joining Sean and the very best of luck for Saturday. Thank you very much.